Okay, so I just want to show uh, the world my digital audio workstation running Ubuntu Linux. Here, as you can see, this is the screen. Um, I'm running Ardour uh, with a song that I recorded with many tracks already. And if you, I'll just play it right away. Here. And if you can see, sorry, the light's not too good. You can see, uh, I'm I'm using a Pentium 4 2.8 gigahertz uh, machine with a half a gig of RAM, 80 gigabyte hard drive, and I'm I'm piping the audio out to a boombox. So I can also listen to headphones here. I just plug it right in. So I'm also I also have here a little mixing board that's not connected to anything right now. And here is a em Emu X board 61. And um, here I can hook it up to uh, MIDI programs that programs that read MIDI inputs, and I can just play whatever. On the machine here, I have um, various uh, audio programs. Also, with Ubuntu, I'm also running Ubuntu Studio, which has a real-time kernel. That means that there's very little, little to no latency at all when um, playing audio back and forth from multiple inputs and outputs. So here are programs you can't see too well though, but I have Ardour. Um, Jammin, which is a uh, mastering interface, LMMS, Muse, Muse Score, uh, Terminator X, uh, Zine Add Sum Sub FX, Software Synthesizer, and anything you would ever wish for with audio. We also have uh, two video programs here, Kino and Stop Motion, for creating stop motion animations. I've never tried it out, I don't think I will. Um, I recently installed Renoise, which is amazing. It's a audio tracker, which is different than a, it's kind of like a sequencer, but instead of um, playing, it le uh, playing a linear uh, timeline, uh, you actually have a drop down uh, timeline with, you just have to check it out. It's really neat. Uh, but I'm using the demo version, but I can just pipe the audio into our door and, I'll be, and it'll be fine. So it's kind of like a hack. Anyway, enough of my rambling. Um, so it's just a regular Linux uh, Ubuntu computer, but geared towards multimedia with all these, all the audio applications installed. Uh, this is the Jack, uh, the Jack Control GUI. It's currently running right now, and these are all the inputs and outputs for. This is the output ports for Ardour and they're going to the system here which is playback. Um, let's see what else. I think I can just crank the volume to be able to hear it. Here. I play the guitar uh, and sing. And over here, um, here I have also a little microphone that I can connect to the board through um, XLR cable, and from there I can control the imp uh, the levels uh, and then pipe it into the computer. Finally. Now, a better setup would be to have an interface, a USB uh, module for uh, audio. So I'd be able to plug the. Um, oh, let me turn this on. I'd be able to plug XLR inputs, outputs, uh, audio inputs, and have it all digitally inputted into the computer. Uh, I think it's called an MMC controller. Uh, and then the various programs would be able to read the input from that device. I don't have that, um, but I'm sure it's not very expensive. But for now, this is just this is just.